I couldn't think this way. I was thinking that I would easily have the letter on this area, but it seems like this is not strong enough. So I have to figure out that stuff. I probably should go back to take the, uh, the marble one with me. Yeah, I think I should. Oy. This is the things I didn't expect. Oh my gosh. Let's go back to take the marble and let's check if it's gonna work or not. I hope so. Wait. I really hope so, otherwise I will have no letters on it. Oh my gosh. Please, please, please. Okay, let's try.
copper that's the length of it mm. but this time looks better I think the letter of my stamp is a little bit too thin so that's why it looks like a little bit too thin uh, anyway Let's give you another try that I think this time is better. So quite happy with that result and let's try again. Never give up. This time, E is not doing well. Let's try another one. I think the spacing is a little bit not good about creature part. R E A T. The spacing and antenna T and an E this part is not that well right but so far I got one looks a little bit okay this one is like two to five mm. I need to do another one again yeah let's try another one If I can put the name tag on here, it's gonna be awesome, no? I think yes, but seems like I cannot do it right now because the words. No, I shouldn't give up so fast. I should try again with stumbling on it and let's see. I have to try more. I already waste four pieces of this but um, yeah I still can have two to go if it's not gonna work <laughs> anyway I have to try again let's do it It's not hurting me because I have to try this and make this work. I hope so. <laughs> Another try. <laughs> How many I tried so far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So now it's gonna be my thirteen. And I found out that it is super good that I start with antenna that make me confident. And then I can start with creature because R is the tricky one and E as well. But now A is no more that problem anymore. So, give it a try again. Every time gonna be better. Okay. Oh, too hard. Be lighter poem. Okay. E. E is the tricky one that with the lower part. Let me check. Is there something wrong with the surface? No. I think needle felt is much easier than this one.
and I'm starving now. I should cook something to eat. I haven't eaten my lunch yet. What time is it already? It's gonna be half past one. I think I kind of figured it out what is the problem between this whole process and I wanted to record this and kind of like give myself the feedback and if in the future I want to do it again I have to remember this part and also get, share these ideas for you that if you want to do something and you wanted to avoid this mistake that I already tried many of them to um, stem on the copper but um, in the beginning I was trying like get used to it of that strike that strength to that one strike and then later on I have to learn how to hold the, um, the metal stem and find this, this that I figured it out is my finger. In the beginning, I was touching it like upper or lower, and the other times that I was doing is like my finger should against to the surface or not, like should be like this or hanging on the air or not, like this way. I was trying it many times, and in the end, the best way is my finger is like this. And then is just touch the surface, but not really strong, like crazy strands against to the surface, not just like touching them. And then later on, the ambulance. <laughs> and then later on, the other thing I learned is if you look at this one, that um, in the beginning I only use the tab from the left and the right and the bottom and I didn't use any tab on the top for one copper and I found out that um, this mistake gave me a lot of chance to when I give it a heat uh, strike like this one if I give it one strike like this and then the copper is easily bounced back and so what I figured it out is I should use another tab on the top so it will secure the full edge. And the other thing is um, the hammer. In the beginning, I bought this one, the hammer that with metal, but um, the outer surface is the rubber, is plastic, and. Then I find out that this is not heavy enough. How heavy is this one? E, not quite sure how many gram of this, but it's quite light. And so when I try to use this one, it's really just slightly. How can I describe it? Like lightly have that initial character on that is not really like apparent apparently enough and then later on I was thinking is that the problem with this hammer should I buy another one is the metal one so I went and bought another one is this this is the completely metal one hammer on the top and it's quite heavy and in the beginning I was thinking should I buy the smaller one or just buy a heavy one and I was thinking like if that is the lighter hammer and but the surface is metal maybe it's gonna work like this one so that's why I decided to buy a heavy one and turns out that yes the heavy one it works better but the point is that you have to be care of the strength, the effort you give it because it gonna bounce back in some case and especially for some character that I was doing is really really 
difficult to deal with like R, A, E, um, the rest of the character I didn't, the capital I didn't try, so I'm not quite sure for from A to Z which are the most difficult one, but for in my case it's like this. Um, yeah, that's all what I experienced during this whole process. Oh, by the way, there is another thing I wanted to mention in here. Yes, let me <laughs> share with you. For in my personal experience, that is my personal character, I think. I'm not quite sure you will be the same or not. But um, I wanted to share you honestly with my experience that I am the person I plan things and I think and I imagine and I figure out that how should I do and I will do it by myself and I sometimes that is like this if I thinking everything and like if I thoroughly thinking everything every process and then I will have the expectation thinking that ah, I'm gonna do it well and it's gonna work. So every time I have this kind of problem that if things are not go well and I will have that disappointed and anger, not really angry but really sad and a little bit angry of why I cannot make it work. And before I was learning to deal with this problem and this time I was thinking again and I give myself like four times or five times that I can uh, experiment it and if it's not working okay but I didn't let myself thinking the way is I can give up Never. I never set up this kind of um, mindset to do everything. And so, yesterday when I try, I have a little bit frustrated. And this morning when I try, I have more frustrated when it's not... When it is not okay. And this is really, really bad that... I kind of kill myself that I like blaming myself why you are not doing it well what happened how come you shouldn't be like this or blah 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 but in the end I was almost have the idea thinking that okay maybe this time I have to give up if it's not working okay fine just forget about this part because this is not the initial plan I just wanted to add some, um, you can say that it's flavor, like have different look or feeling when you attach on it, it will look better. At least for me, I feel like this way, but maybe for others it's okay. So I was thinking, okay, maybe I'm too hard or <laughs> it is too harsh. Um, so. After this morning, and I was trying and trying and trying, like many many times, and later on I was thinking, okay, try more times. If it's not working, okay, fine. At least I try. But if I don't try, I already spent a lot of money on the tools and buying the copper, and what else? Like. I waste my money but I didn't learn anything or experience something so in the end it turned out like okay I have to try to be fully focused on every step I was doing and then know what is problem in there maybe I can figure it out maybe I'm not but at least I have to pay attention on the moment the movement every part step to try to know what is the problem so that's why I have that conclusion before that I told you what probably I should avoid or next time if you want to try or I, I want to try again, I can remind myself.
yeah, let's see. <laughs> That's all what I have experienced right now. And what I have to do right now is I have to smooth this outer edge, the surface of the corner that I wanted to make it a little bit round because now it's too sharp. Uh, yeah, let's see if it works or not. I was trying it a little bit yesterday, not quite sure, but I will try again now. And let's check how it looks. Okay, one more thing that I didn't mention about that uh, what I wanted to say is if you are a perfectionist as well and you are frustrated when you are making things is not working or it didn't turn out it, don't, it didn't come, come out with the result as you want then don't be sad and don't be frustrated and don't be angry of yourself because after many times trying you're gonna make it work like for this time that i stamp on the copper and in the beginning i was frustrated but i was telling myself pong this is your first time doing this stuff so why you should be so hard to yourself and you want to make it work as the first time you use it and you are learning it by yourself you didn't take a course or anything why you think that it's gonna work so yeah I just wanted to remind you if you are the same as me then don't be too harsh okay things is gonna go well if we practice it more and more times but in the first time that's it's normal mm -hmm.